Hello everybody, Tim Nidell here. I kind of wanted to make this quick video to let you guys know what I've been up to the past year because I don't know if you've noticed, but I haven't posted a new video in almost a year on this channel. But that's because I am in the middle of rebranding this channel, making it truly like really high quality and very professional. So you may have noticed the name change already on YouTube. It's not just called Tim Nidell. So now it's gonna be called Pressing Rewind with Tim Nidell. And right now I am at my future set. This here is my future set. I know it doesn't look great because I don't want to reveal everything quite yet, but this is kind of where I'll be filming most of the videos that I'll be putting on YouTube. Of course, back there, I'm not going to have the TV and posters that you see right now. I'll have really cool retro things in the background. And these stupid sheets won't be covering these items because I have some pretty awesome stuff underneath these sheets that I cannot wait to reveal. But I, I can reveal the intro to the new YouTube channel. Here it is right now. So that's the intro that you'll see in front of every one of these videos. And I can show you one of my background props because I guess you might say that she's kind of the, uh, one of the mascots for this YouTube channel. And I'm talking about Greta Gremlin. Oh, I just love this little statue here. So she'll be in the background in uh, most of the videos that I do. Now let's talk about some of the videos that I'll be making. Um, most of you might know me from Saturday Morning Rewind where I've interviewed voice actors from my childhood for almost 11 years now. A lot of the videos are gonna be interview based, but it won't be just animation. It's gonna be a span of everything. It's gonna be live action TV, movies, uh, musicians, um, maybe even sports figures pop culture figures, maybe some comic book creators, but I'll keep that retro theme going because I just love stuff prior to the year 2000. And like I said, I've been doing interviews for 11 years now for Saturday Morning Rewind, but you might not know that I've actually been doing interviews for 20, 22 years. I've been doing interviews for 22 years. I started interviewing rock bands that I loved as a teenager. And then I moved on to actors and TV and film. And then I stopped doing that and just focus on voice actors. And here's just a quick clip of some of the people that I've interviewed in the past. I must break you. I'm George, George McFly. You think you know me? Because the way you're looking at me, we must be old friends. What's the world I, know? I am Chris Jericho. <laughs> yeah. Nothing can take away these blues. At last, we will reveal ourselves to the Jedi. This ain't no charity case. Millions of beaches. Water! Water! One person can make a difference. I'm Lieutenant Dan Taylor. Depends on the topic. My fenders don't really whip me into a verbal frenzy. It's really simple. We just got to make an agreement. How did you find me, Superman? Maybe we can still heal you. These wounds won't seem to heal. I am still living with your leave lovely. A little juice. And they'll say that to me. I'm also going to keep vlogging because I like vlogging, but I'll keep it retro based, maybe historically based as well. You know, maybe I'll go to the last blockbuster and uh, I'll do some filming locations of some popular 80s movies and maybe not so popular 80s movies as well. I'll be doing those. So I don't know if you guys remember, but I used to do this show with my buddy Christian where we would unbox retro toys. I'm going to continue doing that. Um, maybe not open every box toy because it got expensive doing that. I'll also be doing some like maybe some top 10 videos, top 10 favorite blah blah blahs. Um, really, the videos, I, I haven't really fully planned these exactly so it's all going to change I'm, I'm sure i'll add some other things like i've been toying around with doing a game show on here one thing i'm excited about is that i will be making many documentaries on this channel all retro based of course 
I already have some ideas for the first handful of documentaries. Of course, those won't be cheap. I do need to travel for most of those. So they won't be an every month type of thing, maybe like once a year, twice a year type of thing. Um, of course, if the channel gets some steam and uh, get some revenue, I can do it way more often. But documentaries, that's one thing I'm really excited about because I think I have some, some really good ideas for some retro-based mini documentaries that I don't think I've seen or heard anybody else talk about. So I'm excited about that. And um, yeah, I guess that's about it. I hope to have vi videos soon-ish. It all kind of depends on when I can get all my equipment in and when I can finish the set here. And I guess that's kind of where you guys can come in. I did start a GoFundMe page. And if you want to help out, I mean, I would just take even a dollar from each one of you. That would really help out, honestly. But if you want to help me finish up with the show, like I need a new camera, I need a couple more lights, a lot more production items to make it really look like a professional set. So check out the GoFundMe page and for the first handful of people who donate $100 or more, I'm going to display your name on an item here in the set. For example, I, I started the GoFundMe about seven months ago, and my buddy Neil Alday donated $100. So Neil, your name is going to be proudly shown in most of my videos on this cool retro board that I picked up, this cool menu board. So of course I'll have other stuff on this board. Won't quite reveal what I have planned yet, but this board's gonna be featured at the end of most of my videos. And Neil's name is gonna be down there in almost every video because he donated $100. And if you do the same, I have some ideas for displaying your name. Like these seats that I'm sitting in, I have three seats from my local movie theater that after they close down, I pick them up. And right here, there's a spot to put a little tag. So I will put dedicated by blah, blah, blah. So there's three of them, three seats, three di different dedications. And I'm thinking if there's a fourth person who donates this shelf right back here, there's a perfect spot to mount a nameplate dedicated by blah, blah, blah. So if you want to help us out, please think about going to the GoFundMe page. I am also going to put down there a link in the description where you can pick up a shirt with the new logo. And I think I get about six bucks a shirt that sells from Tee Public, So that would really help out as well. And plus you'll be advertising for me, so that'll be awesome. But uh, anyways, can't wait to reveal what I have going on. I mean, it, it's, it's going to be great. I'm not just saying that. I really, truly feel this is going to be a great channel. A great family-friendly, honestly. I mean, it might be a little PG-13-ish every now and then, because I'll do some live Twitch streaming of video games. So it might be a little PG-13-ish every now and then, but I don't go hard R. You know, if you know me, I'm pretty much family-friendly. So stay tuned. Probably won't have any new videos on this channel for a little while. But when I do... It's going to be awesome.